YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Uh, many of you do not know that uh, I'm a military veteran. All right. Uh, I'm prior Navy. And uh, I was uh, tasked to uh, do the uh, aviation operations. Okay, so uh, um, so I was in I was in uh, in charge of all the aviation operations. All right. Uh, uh, one of the dangerous, one of the most dangerous jobs uh, in, in the world is what they listed as. Uh, so, hangar bay, flight ops, uh, flight deck, flight ops. Uh, you, you, you could probably imagine some of you uh, how how uh, I was. Uh, uh, in the eye of danger 24-7 or at least while I was on the job uh, so uh, we would work 12 hours on 12 hours off and uh, a lot of the uh, operations you know we there would be all kinds of things that you would have to look out for that could literally kill you uh, while moving on a ship so we are uh water soldiers or or uh, uh yeah that's what I would call it water water soldiers we were out to sea constantly soldiers on the water all right so um i say that to say this uh when i give you my input uh my opinion, uh, my wisdom, my knowledge, my wherewithal is because I've seen much. Uh, I've been um, on the inside, um, as many of you guys have looked on the outside, okay? So, I'm on the outside now, I'm no longer in the Navy, all praises to the Most High. Um, did my four and came out. Uh, so I want to touch bases on uh, the Ukraine and Russia um, situation and what black people are to do uh, and I'm not just speaking to all of black people because I know some of you black people are too far gone and I am not trying to uh, attach myself to you I am not trying to uh, 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 advise you on anything I know you're you're too far gone I'm speaking to the Israelites that uh, the prophets of the hood uh, I'm speaking to uh, the apostles of the hood uh, I'm speaking to those that are Israelite by blood, specifically, uh, not by uh, being uh, uh, converted into, uh, I'm not speaking to any of those people. I'm speaking to Israelites specifically that are Israelites by blood. And I'm not talking to the two thirds. Uh, because like I said, you're too far gone off. Uh, and obviously you, it's been showed that you have, you, have, you have ventured so far off, I'm not sure what's gonna happen to you. Uh, but for those that want to know what uh, the inside of the military uh, and what you should be doing in this time, uh, in this hour, uh, First and foremost, um, you should be preparing. Uh, and when I say preparing, you know, 
you need to be uh, equipped for war, protecting yourself, your family, if you have a family, wife and kids. Uh, you need to be in a situation where uh, interchangeably you can make moves on a moment's notice okay I'll say that again you need to be able to interchangeably make moves at a moment's notice alright so uh, you need to make sure that um uh, you have proper gear for for cold, for being in the cold. All right, so you need, you know, like you see what I have on. All right, I have a nice bubble coat, keeps me really warm. And then I also keep another like light jacket, hoodie, zipping up jacket, hoodie underneath that. And then I have a t-shirt and then a t-shirt under the t-shirt. All right, so. If anything was to pop off interchangeably, I don't care which weather, if I had to make it to a warmer climate, I could easily get down into, uh, you know, uh, shed some of the, the clothing. If I had to stay in the, in the mountain somewhere, I'm able to do that, all right? I have gloves on both sides, two sets of gloves on both sides. You need to have, you need to start being prepared, okay? Uh, and you need to think uh, ahead of uh, all of the Gentiles, okay? Um, if not, then you're going to find yourself in a situation that you are going to be mad at yourself because you didn't listen to what I said. So two coats, okay? I have another coat. It's a pea coat, and that's, you know, really cold, warm, you know, really cold climates, all right? So I have two sturdy coats okay uh one is more you know uh you know pocket accessible right and then i have the p coat uh and that's really a really good coat all right you're also going to need two pair of boots i always uh promote boots and the boots that i promote is the acgs uh nike acgs because you, you remember i said interchangeable that's a key word look it up you need to be able to interchangeably be able to make a move in moments notice. So the AC, the reason I recommend the ACG is because they are interchangeable. All right. It's a boot, but it's also a shoe, a tennis shoe. All right. It's a boot, but it also gives you all of the benefits of a tennis shoe. You understand? All right. You'll thank me later. Buy them. It doesn't matter how much they cost you need to have them okay thank me later and you'll say okay i see why all right i won't go into why those are necessary just believe what i say acg nike boots they'll run you around 150 if you got a military if you get if you x if you are connected to the military in any any, any kind of way let night let a foot locker know that you're a military veteran or military whatever and they will give you a discount you can get them for around 150 160 depending on what type of sales they got but they will give you a discount all right i'm getting ready to order me a pair as soon as i get upstairs all right acgs all right the other pair of shoes that i would i would recommend you to get is some type of boot uh just a, a regular boot uh, you can get combat boots, uh, you can get Timberland boots, you can get the hiking Timberland boots, any kind of boot. You're going to need two pair of boots. Don't get into this tennis shoe running situation, all right? They're going to fold on you. You need an AC, you need a boot, something that is durable, something that uh, holds your ankles nice and tight so you don't get a sprained ankle when you're traveling on foot if you have to, whatever you're doing. So you don't have any mishaps. It'll make sense later. You'll thank me later. All right. So two coats, two pair of boots. 
very necessary. All right. Now, also what you're going to need, and this is the big one. This is really huge, really huge. Okay. Uh, you're going to have to have a high moral standard. Exactly. You're going to have a high, you're going to have to have a high moral standard. Uh, you're going to have to keep high morals. Okay. Uh, I know it don't make sense to you now and it's okay, but I at least gave you the information. You're going to need to have morals and they're going to need to be high. Okay. Uh, that's all I have for now. Oh, and also, uh, be careful, especially uh, black people. Be very, very careful who you listen to. Uh, that is saying things to the musical note of which oppressor to choose. Okay? Be very careful of those individuals that are promoting you to pick which oppressor over the other oppressor. Okay? Like I said, I'm specifically speaking to Israelites by blood. You do not choose any of these oppressors, okay? I wouldn't care if it's Donald Trump. I wouldn't care if it's Biden. I wouldn't care if it's uh, Vladimir uh, over there in Russia. You are not to pick any of these oppressors, okay? Until you find someone that is a natural blood Israelite like you, that is in that office, then that's who you choose. But other than that, you leave them with their politics. You leave them with their witchcraft. You leave them with their dishonesty. You leave them with all of the uh, pagan gods that they pray to. You do not choose any of your oppressors. And a flag should go off for anyone that tells you that you are to pick or one is better if you had a choice to choose one. You are to be very careful in what that person says. The flag should go off because we know what it says in the Bible. Okay? So, be very careful because the Bible says do not choose any of those oppressors. Okay? So, you be very careful of those individuals that are promoting one oppressor over the other or giving you inclinations which one they would choose over the other all right don't be deceived because even the very elect is going to be deceived all right and i hope this video has made sure that you are not deceived and you stay in the category of the very elect that will be saved you guys take it easy.